Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to open a port or how to access a port by writing a firewall rule so that that port can be accessed by all the VMs in the project or uh, specific VMs in the project on Google Cloud Platform. Let's go. So basically there is two ways to do this. So one would be like you have a VM instance up and running. Say you go click on here. Then you're going to go scroll down and you're going to go to the network. And then you're going to scroll down and you're going to see here firewall rules. And then you're going to click add a firewall rule. So this is one way. The another one way would be like going to the navigation menu and going to the VPC network. It says firewall. And adding here both does the same thing. So let's do click on a firewall rule. So what this basically does is it allows a port to be accessed by one of the specification you give. So let's give us a custom name saying that port. So port description. So we call so ingress. So if you if you guys yeah ingress applies to the traffic that are incoming ingress applies to the outgoing so if you want some stuff to be received you guys can give ingress if you guys want to send some stuff you can give egress so now we give egress and then this targets you got you guys have to give all instances in the network meaning that all the instances that say i have three instances all this pool is going to be applicable there and you can source filter I, so me, meaning that the ips can be filtered meaning that only some ips can be using these machines or the machines with have this specific ips can access this rule so for now we want all the machines with the ips access this so i'm going to go 0 .0 0 .0 0 0 0 Then I'm gonna go. If you guys want to allow all the ports, you guys can give allow all. Or if you guys want to specify some ports and protocols, so if you guys use, you're gonna use TCP. You guys can click this, and then use any of the ports that you feel like. So I'm gonna use say 8089. I'm gonna click this. If you're gonna use UDP, you can go and do UDP. Say 520, or you want to do some other, say 799, and then create rule. So, when you create this rule, meaning that the port 799 TCP is going to be available to all the instances in your network, meaning in the project. So, this is how you turn on a port in GCP. Thank you. If you guys have any queries, you guys can leave a comment or send a mail. See you. See you again.